What what was it like opening for James Brown? Um, was it? Well, we were like, uh, you know, like I said, we were just a local band. We we played in, in the local clubs and uh, we were told one day that we were going to be the opening band for James Brown and it was in a stadium and that we were going to get to meet him. We were three girls. At that time, we went from being called Friday, Saturday and Sunday to the Jewels. So we were sort of like the Supremes, but we sung all the uh, top 10 hits at that time. So, yeah, we 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 were taken backstage and we met James Brown and all the things you heard about him, he was saying to the guys, you make sure those shoes are shiny. I want to see my face in those shoes and stand up when these ladies walk. I mean, we were young girls and he was like, stand up when these ladies walk into the room and the whole band stood up. We were looking at each other like, because we never experienced anything like that. <laughs> and he was saying, you you want to be famous? You want to be singers? We, like, we don't want to be famous. We're just having fun. And, you know, he was very nice, very cordial. Wow. Yeah. So that was, uh, I mean, we were excited about that. But still, for me, I never wanted to be famous. And funny enough, uh, I guess about maybe seven years ago, I opened for James Brown in Monte Carlo at Formula One for the drivers. Uh, uh, they have this charity and they have different artists there. And James Brown and myself were on the show. <laughs> it was quite weird. <laughs> 